Hello, in this video we are going to discuss the lead code problem number 942 DA string match. The word DA means D for decrease the value, right? D for decrease. Same way I for increase. what they will give they will give you an string right a string input is a string right they will give you an string yes what the string contains only the letters i i and d the combination of both i i, I and d or full i or full d whatever it is but the string only contain i and d right what you need to return we need to return an array which contains only integer right we need to return integer array integer array right we need to return integer array but what is the condition n plus 1 integers right our output array would contain n plus 1 Wha here n is the length of the string if the string has 3 letters right the length is 3 we need to return an array which contains integers of length 4 we need to return 4 integers right if the string has 3 characters if the string has 10 characters we need to return 11 digits array right 11 elements array we need to return then they give what is that the integers range is from 0 to n right our array's lower limit is our result resultant array's lower limit is 0 the higher limit is what n St uh, length of the string if they will give you three character string right this string you need to return an array which contains 0 to 3 of integers right this is what they will give you the condition we know that mm, da stands for decrease and increase i just uh, uh, in the start of the probe uh, in the starting of the problem our uh, range is what uh, lower value lower value is 0 right higher value is length of the array which is in our example it is 3 right at the start of the problem we have this data then if we find found any i right if we found any i we need to increment i i stands for increment so we need to increase the lower value right if the string has i first we put 0 right after that if another i will come we need to increase the value of i if another i come we need to increase the value of i right the same way if if we found the first d in our string we need to put the high value right 3 if we find another d value we need to decrement right this is the logic from logic for our question uh, for example if uh, le, let me check the question id id right they give id id 
this is what they give in the first example right sorry i just here what is the value of length 4 right string length we need to return an array of what values 5 values right n plus 1 value here 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 we need to found 5 values what is the low value 0 high value is 4 right you first i have i so i put 0 here then i found an d so i go for high right 4 then i found another i so i need to add the i value right 0 to 1 then i found another d value so i decrement the highest value 3 right there are four values are printed right uh, first four values we need to found the last value right if you check uh, what is the if we apply this logic we get the fifth one as what same right high equal to low that position we attained right we use all the characters so the final value is is the value where high and low will be equal right 0 1 2 if we increment the uh, low value you will get 2 or just decrement the uh, high value you will get what fifth value so both are same uh, if you use low you just increment it will go to 2 if you use high you just decrement it will go to 2 so we do not need to worry about the last uh, last value so i just move to the coding part we need to first find the length of the string length right length of string right uh, okay int i just named as n uh, s dot length which is just give me the length of the string then i need to create an array right which contains of integer for our output purpose right int result array i just named as result array equal to new int what is the size of the array we need to return n plus 1 right length plus 1 okay then what is the range right range here 0 to n so int lower range sorry lower range is equal to 0 int higher range is equal to what is that mm. n plus 1 right sorry n then we need to fill our we need to fill our what uh, result array right result array so i go for an loop int sorry i equal to 0 then i greater than n for what we have the string of length n so i just go for first strings length right 0 to n uh, sorry n minus 1 that is what uh, uh, less than n right i plus plus here i uh, if they will give you four letters i just fill the first four elements of the array 
right here what is i am trying to do is that then if the character right uh, char at if ith position equal to equal to i right increment i just um, what result array uh, i just add the lower range right first i add the lower range if the first uh, character is i we just add the lower range zero then we need to sorry this i right then we need to increment the lower range right else we can you can use uh, s dot char at i equal to equal to d or you can use this method also uh, if it is i just increment the lower value if it is other than i uh, we just decrement the uh, what is that higher value i is equal to speak equal to higher range right ha ha sorry higher range minus minus right then we fill this first four positions because this uh, string has length of four we have an another position right another element we need to fill so result array uh, n right nth position uh, what is that mm. yeah nth position right yeah we are filling from 0 to uh, n right so we need to add the nth position what is that uh, yeah we can use both higher range or lower range because if you increment what is if you increment the lower value it will go to 2 if you decrement the higher value it will go to 2 so you can use anything right higher range or lower range this is our prof our problem is entered we need to return what return the result array result array right i just run the code so we return array is equal to equal to not here what happens here result array array what it's not a statement sorry equal to equal to sorry that is small mistake Ray n you cannot find the simple h i g yeah spelling mistake sorry for sorry for everything yeah it's run successfully so we need to submit yeah it is running successfully thank you for watching if you have any doubt contact me on instagram thank you or leave the comment